it's like how am I gonna do this hi um sorry um I think I'm gonna have to figure out something here um can you hold on for a moment hello again um hold on i feel like there how's that hmm is that good okay so today is what's today 17th of June, July uh, 2014 and I think it's gonna be the first consider this the first of many um, audio vlogs because it's gonna be a video format but it's gonna be just audio um, and I'm doing this because I am just a little depressed and sad. No, not sad. Uh, a little depressed and bored. So. Hello. Um, I'm not going to be using my real name. Because. Well, I don't actually like my name to begin with. But. I don't know. I just. I just don't want to. Um. <clears throat> anyway. So. Yeah. That's what I'm. Uh, anyway, I, hopefully this is going to be just about 12 minutes long. So I need to think of something. What am I going to say? Why am I doing this, actually? So, recently, I have... Well, not recently. Two years ago, after graduating high school in 2012. I'm 19 now. Um, I lost a lot of people who I would talk to daily. And that came as, as a shock. Because months after graduating, I, me and my family was evicted from our house. I had to give away one of my dogs. And we were forced to live into an apartment where we were scared to go outside because of the people. Um, the west side of the city. Um... So that was hard enough, okay? And but the, no one was there. No one talked to me anymore. I had like two people who, who would actually talk to me. Well, three, technically. I had two personal people who I actually knew um, in real life. And then I had one internet friend, Summer. Uh, so, and uh, yeah. And the other two were Javen and John. I'm going to be using, I guess, real names. I don't know. So, yeah, and recently, um, I lost, uh, like, about f five months ago, I stopped talking to Javen and John, only recently have I actually started talking to them again, but it was a, it's a complicated story, and I'll just, I'll do it tomorrow, if I have to, um, if I have to explain or whatever, um, well, I mean, I probably will, anyway, so, I recently came I came we kind of met in the middle of coming back together and uh, talking. Uh, John and Javen don't talk to each other. That so was like two separate occasions of me going halfway between people. Um, <clears throat> but the internet comrade that I had, uh, she found out my real name, which ruined the little relationship that we had to begin with. Um, so I stopped talking to her. And I, I completely understand. It's like, oh, that's not, it's nothing to go to you're overreacting on something really little. I mean, yes, it is, but it's important to me. I like the sense of anonymity, and I don't like... Because, like, once you know someone's name, and you know their friend, and she found out where I lived, um, kind of. She, like, she, she knows, like, the state I am. It's not that hard to really find somebody, okay? And I just, I don't want that. Like, I don't actually have any personal emails or personal... Like, I don't even have a Facebook and all that. So she can't really find me. But I'm sure there's something about me out there somewhere from other people's stuff. So I didn't want to risk it. And I don't care. So I stopped talking to her. So, yes. And then I uh, 
but within the four months of not talking to my personal comrades, I found pen pals, but then they stopped talking to me as well. So I'm all, I'm kind of all alone right now. I have two people. I, well, one and a half. The other person's a drug addict, and it's kind of hard to tell if it's actually like a real camaraderie. Camaraderie? I think it's camaraderie. So, yeah. Um, <clears throat> so that sucks, you know? That's not something I w- wanted to happen, but it happened, so I, I can't do anything about it. So I have one and a half. I mean, I consider it one and a half. And technically, it's two people, but it's one and a half. And... I'm just at a loss of why things keep happening like this. Um, I'm a, I, I'm antisocial. I have phobias. I used to be, I used to have obsessive compulsive behaviors. Uh, but I've, I've grown out of it, thankfully, because like, I don't know. Um... I still have phobias, I have phobia of germs, um, heights, people, meeting new people, embarrassing myself, um, doing new things. I just don't like it. Um, <clears throat> so it's hard for me to, to do things, to, you know, I can't get a job because they can't hire somebody who's embarrassed to do the interview. Uh, and I have no skills whatsoever. Um, and all the jobs that you suppose, like all the first, everyone has like a first job, you know, like there's a, there's a, there's a first job type. It's like, it's usually the bad ones. Like, and, but I can't be doing that cause I have, I have focus. Like I can't do cleaning and all that stuff cause I'm afraid of germs. Um, I can't be the cash register cause I'm afraid of people and I'll, I'll, I'll faint in front of, oh, I mean, I won't faint, but like, it's hard. I mean, it's hard for me to do this stuff. And I understand you have to work through it and you have to like, once you get used to doing it, it shouldn't like, and you have, you know, but it's hard for me, you know, I can't like literally today, it's my sister's graduation party and I can't go because there's going to be people there and I don't want to be there when there's people. So, I'm here at, at the apartment, watching the dog. I mean, like, I wanted to be here anyway because of the dog. I have a, I'm, I'm scared to leave her by herself for too long, so I'm here anyway. Um, so, yeah. <clears throat> and, um, I, I'm, I, and, and I thought, like, this would be a good time to do this. So, that's what I'm doing. I'm doing this. And, um. Yeah. Sorry, I keep being distracted because there's a blood in my ear. Because I guess I have ear acne. Which is horrible. But, I mean, it doesn't happen that often. Like, once in a great while. But for some reason, I had, like, these horrible... I just had this horrible one in my right ear. And there's, like, it's still... It doesn't hurt anymore. But, it's like, blood... Heart, like, crusted blood. And I can't get it out. I have I don't know what to do. I've tried, like, a, you know... I don't know. And with my other ear, like, on the, um, like, not the lobe, the, 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 the it's like, I don't, I don't even know what it's called, but I had another one over there as well, and, like, I actually had another one on my right lobe as well. It's so weird. I don't know why it happened, but this past, like, two and a half weeks, I just had, like, these random bursts of acne on my ears. I don't know what happened, but, um, yeah, and, uh. Also, this is an audio vlog because I don't like the way I look, um, which I it's you know it's a self confidence thing. But I'm I'm not I'm not that you know bland not bland I'm not that uh, blind to what is attractive and what isn't, and I know I'm not something people want to look. I mean, I, actually, I don't even actually I don't even have a video thing, so I have to do it like that anyway. I mean, I have to do it like this anyway because I don't have a. Um, a clear enough video, but yeah. Anyway, so yeah, so that's the thing. I'm gonna. Tr- I don't know how how much I'm gonna be doing this, but I'm gonna be doing like once a day, not once a day. But, well, I mean, if I can, yeah, totally. I'll try to do it once a day. Um, but I need to figure out a way to render the video quickly, 
and uh, and then I'll publish it as well because I, I need to figure out some way to do a low version of the video itself so don't, I don't have to render it at like 70, 20, 720p or whatever um, and and then have to wait so long to get it online so um, yeah because like because this is like 10 minutes right all right so so yeah that's what i'm going to be doing and i'm going to be completely honest of everything that's going to happen um well i mean i mean i'm sure there's going to be some things that i just can't say like oh man i just have gas because i don't have gas right now i did actually i remember coming out of the car and going i have gas um but i don't have any more so but i'm going to be completely honest um with a lot of these things so um yeah and i'm just gonna be talking about my daily life so let's do it today um i woke up at around well i stayed up late a little bit than usual because i was trying to learn how to do cgi not cgi but um um computer modeling but i can't because my mouse doesn't have a third it doesn't the wheel the scroll whatever doesn't work on my mouse so we can't i can't even use the blender it's a blender it's called blender and so i can't even do it like that and it's too complicated because I'm, I'm too stupid to do it um but i wanted to learn it to make a small trailer for something but i can't do it so i went to sleep at around two something i woke up at seven to the sound of my father going hey you need to wake up you need help with things and then i did and i got yelled at most of the time because i'm too slow i don't know how to do things so yep and then finally the party started like about an hour ago about an hour and 20 minutes ago so <clears throat> and people are there and finally things were going on um i helped as much as i could without overexerting myself and now i'm back here in about 20 minutes i have to walk my dog and uh watch you too her name is what you do named after the Wachitu tribe at ace ventura pet detective when nature calls because she was a biter and that tribe was a biter and it bit the main character so i was like oh, okay cool um it's a weird name i'll admit but uh, it fits her um she's been sick today she threw up once that i know of i don't know if she threw up twice so i'll be walking her hopefully fairly um soon and I hope she defecates, not because I like picking up after her, but you will know, let me know that it's out. And then I'll take, after coming back, I'll, um, oh my god, my food! Oh my god. <laughs> you just see, that's the reality. It's that's realism there, people. I was cooking food thinking it would only take me ten minutes to do this and I forgot. It, I was supposed to take it out at one six and then leave it out for five minutes, like leave it in the thing for five minutes. Um, but it's one fourteen and I forgot for over seven, eight minutes. Oh. oh, God, I thought I was going to, I mean, like, I'm not, I wasn't completely, like, scared for the food itself. I thought I was c causing a fire. So I was like, oh, my God, what if there's a fire? So I let, that's why I ran. Oh. But they weren't burned. They're um, hot dogs in uh, a croissant thingy. Oh, no, well, I mean, not a croissant. They're called... Pigs in a blanket, and they're mini ones from the dollar store. Or the, well, probably not the dollar store. Maybe I'm not entirely sure. My mother got it for a lunch for me when everyone's gone, because I'm usually here all by myself when everyone's gone. Because my youngest sister has summer school. My younger sister has work at a summer school. She actually works there, not at the summer school that my other sister goes. My older sister actually has a job. My father has a job. My mother has a job, and I'm here. So, and that's why it's hard for me to leave because 
no one's here to take care of the place and I don't trust people and I don't want people to I, I need someone to watch the watch you two when I'm gone so I was like it's difficult for me to leave so like there's a lot of things going against me like it's not just me okay and um and she gets sick sometimes and then like people can't you know you can't control that anyway so I'm I'm making this way a lot, a lot longer than it should have been um <coughs> so I'm gonna have to um, I'm leaving now, so, okay. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Just to recap everything, I'll try to do, like, ten minutes every single day of just talking, you know, saying what happened. Um, anyway, so, like, to recap for the rest of the day, when I come back, I'm eating, I'm gonna eat now, I'm gonna watch Legend of the Korra, the new two episodes, I'm so excited, it's a great show, really great show. They really, really upped it now like the last the first season was good i really liked it the second season was good but it wasn't as good as it could have been could have been sorry um and on the third season so far i love it the first episode the first episode and a half i was like uh eh, not really but then they started traveling the world and that just brought back so much good memories from avatar last airbender and they're like i'm really hoping for a good season um, cause they're starting off really well and I'm, I'm so happy with, with what's going on. Um, so yeah. All right. And, and then I'm going to, after I eat, after I watch the thing, I'm going to um, steal in a Coke from my mother. She drinks, you know, pop or whatever. We're not allowed to drink it. I have three sisters. So like if someone steals it, another person's going to steal it. And then in two days, the entire back is gone. And so anyway, um, and then I'm going to take a shower because I know eventually I'm going to have to help everyone take back all the food, all the stuff back to this place. Oop, sorry. And yeah, all right. And, and that should be the rest of my day. And I'll, I've been reading the Lord of the Rings. Like I've had the book for about a year, I think, but I, I've never read it. I don't know why, but for some reason I started reading it again. Gotta say, not as good as the film. To be, I mean, for the first 50 minutes, not 50 minutes, 50 pages, I kind of like the film better because, like, there's random explanation points like, good day, goodbye, see you soon. Like, just no one talks. I mean, I understand. It's a different place, Middle Earth, way back in the history. People talk differently, but it's just, I don't know, kind of annoying. And um, Smeagol's um, story is different, and they already explained Smeagol's story, and it's just different. Um, so, I mean, understandably, the book came first. So the book is actually, I guess, the Bible. And the movie, it took liberties of what could they do, what they did and what they didn't do. So like, it actually changed the story. But I saw the movies first. So for me, the movies are what I see from Lord of the Rings. Well, first of all, Frodo is 50-something years old. And that's just weird because, like, in the movie... Elijah Wood was like 19 years old <laughs> so it's like I mean it doesn't really matter because I still see him as Elijah Wood going Gandalf what do you mean whoa Frodo Bilbo so, sorry I don't I can't it's like in my head I'm like I can do a pretty good impression but I can't really in real life uh so um don't take me as a conjurer of cheap tricks which was my favorite part, but they didn't put that in. I love that line. Like, I'm not trying to rob you. I'm trying to help you. Ah, uh, Gandalf. Mr. Frodo. Sam. Sorry, this is a lot. I really do like the films. Like, I don't know. Like, it's weird. I'm not obsessed with the films, but I do like watching them. So, anyway. 20 minutes. Half. Twice as long as what it should have been. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. And I've got to... I'm not editing this. It's going to be completely, you know, this, like, like, like this. So, yep. All right. I'll, um, talk to you guys later. You guys can, um, I need a name. Uh, you guys can call me Mr. Burp. Actually, I already made up a name. And my name is Larry Miller. Welcome to my daily audio vlog. I forgot. Uh, I mean, I stopped it already, but I forgot to say something. Um, everything on this channel is going to be completely me just talking. I'm not going to add anything that isn't mine because I don't know. I just I feel like if I add something that isn't mine, it's going to take away the 
the realness of what this is going to attempt to be. Also, I'm not doing this for attention. Well, I mean, actually, I am kind of doing this for attention. But attention in meaning people will talk to me, maybe. So they're like, oh, I mean, like, I don't know. Maybe it's actually be kind of weird because, like, I listen to you all the time. I don't want to talk to you. Um, but, you know, just to get out there, I guess, like, if that makes any sense. So, um, yeah. Uh, and, uh, yep. All right. I'll talk to you guys later again. Uh, goodbye, my listeners. Now listen to this.